Well, people are gearing up for Halloween, buying costumes, candy and decorations. And according to the National Retail Federation, spending is expected to reach a record high. 12 News consumer reporter Sarah Grinelli explains. Sarah? Shannon, Mike, spending on Halloween this year is going up by $2 billion compared to last year. Halloween is right around the corner and people are getting ready to celebrate. Three quarters of Americans, according to the National Retail Federation, are saying we're going to celebrate this year. Since 2020, you can see spending on Halloween has grown from $8 billion to this year, where shoppers are expected to spend $12.2 billion. Kristen Regine, a professor at Johnson & Wales University, says there is a variety of options for shoppers. Costumes, candy, pets, and one of the big trends this year year too is people are having parties at home. So the tablescapes and decor and cutlery and all of the things that go along with throwing a party at your house. The NRF says a person is expected to spend $108.24 this year on festivities. 73% of people say they'll be getting into the spooky spirit. Many will be handing out candy, decorating their homes or yard and dressing in costumes. She says for shoppers looking for deals, they're still out there. Right now, if you go into some of the stores, they're already starting to mark them down, clearance. Some things are 50% off, which is nice. And then really kind of the key is to use coupons, cash back, rewards to try to defray some of the cost of candy. And for those looking for a deal online, Paula Fleming from the Better Business Bureau says if you're shopping online and a deal seems too good to be true, it probably is. Look at the URL and if there's an HTTPS, it means it's secure. So then when you give your credit card information, you know it's a secure website. The NRF also says people are expected to spend $3.6 billion this year just on candy alone. In the studio, Sarah Grinelli, 12 News.